I'm Ricky Lin from Live Tree Biotech. We create plant-based protein that tastes like meat. I grew up with my grandparents and both of them were hawkers. So you can imagine a young boy running around in Topayo Hawker Centre having a large variety of food to choose from. When I went into a competitive sports in my JC, there's a very strong culture of eating healthy and training very hard. So the love for food and interest in technology came together when I was much younger. It dates back to, you know, during my time in primary school when I took part in a science competition. I actually designed a robot and we actually won the first prize. So that gave me confidence to pursue this technological work. So the work of Lifetree is important because we are addressing a future problem today. We have seen how livestock farming and fishing has caused the ecosystem to collapse. And we believe that by developing an alternative food source, we are able to address the issue of healthy, sustainable diet. So the biggest uh, technical challenges will be divided into three categories. First being the taste, second the texture, and third the nutritional requirement. To overcome the technical challenges, Lifetree looks at two main areas, research and innovation. With the years of uh, research and development, we hope to bring Vigo to the rest of the world and promote a healthier, sustainable diet. So the challenges in acquiring talent for our company is due to the fact that people don't really understand what food tech is all about. One of the ways is to partner Workforce Singapore. WSG has a lot of good programs to support startups like us. And they also have this work trial program where we are able to attract talents to join us, but not having to bear the full salary cost. And we believe that with the forward-looking uh, aspect of a food tech company, we should be able to attract new talents who are passionate in making a dent in the universe.